Welcome to ILC Tech Talk. Today we're going to configure some time clocks and map them to relays in our panel. For our purposes, we're going to use a 7 a.m. turn-on timer, a 8 p.m. turn-off timer, and we're going to map it to the first four relays on the left side of the panel, numbers 1, 3, 5, and 7. So let's get started. First we want to go into edit mode. That's going to be our bottom left button here. Now we're looking for timers, which happens to be the third one on the left. And we're looking to configure our timers before we map them to any relays. So, top left. Now you'll notice that timer 001 comes up as unused, so we want to set the time in order to activate it. You can choose normal, astro, or open and close. We're going to use normal time of day. So we're going to choose that. Now you'll notice that it comes up as 12 o'clock a.m., which is the default midnight, unused. And we're going to make it 7 o'clock a.m. Now we can choose to edit minutes or hours, but we don't need to do that. Days comes up as every day of the week. We're going to go into this because we don't want this to happen on Saturday and Sunday. So we're going to disable Sunday. We're going to go down and disable Saturday. Now we can cursor through here and see that it's enabled on the other days of the week, or we can go back and see that Saturday and Sunday are gone. Now we want to go to timer two, so we're going to use our up arrow, go to timer two, which was, again, dis unused. We're going to go in here, we're going to choose normal again. Now we're going to make this our PM timer. I can hold the button down and it'll jump through pretty quickly. 8 o'clock PM is our time. Again, minutes and hours, we don't need to edit the minutes. And we're going to leave it active every day of the week because we still want this to happen on the weekends. So now if we go use our back button, now we can go into timer to relay control. We go into here, you can map it to relays, groups, or presets. We're just going to map it straight to the relays on the left hand side of the panel. So, panel 01, relay 1, timer 1, which is our turn on timer. So we can choose relays and, and change them. We can use choose action and change it. We're going to make this an on action for this relay. We're going to go back here and choose relays, and we're going to use our up arrow, and we're going to choose relay 2 as a no control. 3 is going to be an on, 4, no, 5, on, 6, no, 7, on. That's our first four relays on the left hand side of the panel. Now we can go up here to timer, choose the timer line, and we can go to timer 2. Now we could map these in reverse, or we can just go back to the beginning and we can choose action is going to be off, 3, off, 5, off, 7, off. Now you can cursor through here and see what your relays are set for. Again, it'll go back and forth. You can go all the way to the end and back again if you need to. So that's mapping our four relays to our timers and setting up the timers. So now you can press home and you're all done.